Do you want to convert this type of photo into this photo with more details and changes? Now, we can do this with latest in painting feature by Midjourney. Let's take a look at the release details of this feature before we test how it works. Here is the official announcement for this feature. They don't call it as in painting yet. Its names is very region. According to this, we will get an editor that allows us to change parts of the created images. To get the best out of this feature, we have to edit 20% to 50% area of the image. Also, we can get better results by changing things that is related to original image, rather than completely different changes. Let's see how we can access and use this feature. Let's create an image using the imagine command. Here is the prompt I used. A scenic countryside movie poster, depicting a man fishing in a small row boat on a misty lake, surrounded by forested mountains, reflecting on the still water, in the early morning light. Let's wait for Midjourney to generate the images. Now, we have four stunning images. Let's pick one of them. I am going to pick first one. Let's upscale the image using U1 button. I have an upscaled image now. This is the new button introduced by Midjourney for in painting. It's called Very Region. Clicking on the button opens a window for editing the image. We can just drag and highlight the region that we want to change. I am highlighting the top section of the photo, above the river. Let's click Submit button and see what happens. It seems like Midjourney is creating another set of images for our request. As you can see, the section I highlighted is changed with different type of mountains. The bottom part of the image is same as before. Already, we can see the power of this feature in editing parts of images. I am going to upscale the first one from new set of images. Let's modify this image further by using the in-painting feature again. Let's change the area with trees. Earlier, I used the rectangle tool for selecting the area. Now, I am using the lasso tool to highlight the area. Let's click the submit button. It's generating a new set of images again. This time, I can only see minor changes. I am not sure if it's due to the selection being too small. So far, I only highlighted the area and let Midjourney do the changes. Instead, we can also ask what we want in the selected area. In order to use that feature, we have to enable remix mode by using dash prefer space remix command. Now, remix mode is enabled. Let me upscale the first image. Now, I have to click on very region button again. Here, we have a new editable field with our original prompt. I am going to change the top section again. I am changing the prompt as, thunderstorm with lightning. Let's click submit button and see what happens. Now, we have a new set of images. As you can see, there is a dramatic change in the top section with lightning. This looks amazing. We can change large section of the image with a simple text prompt. Let's try further modifications by upscaling the first image. Click Vary, Region button again to load the editor. Let me highlight an area on the river in the photo. I am adding the new prompt as, a boat with a man and a child. Let's submit and see what happens. Awesome. Now, we have a boat with two people in it. Some of the images got three people in it. But, generally, it's extremely good at first release. Finally, I'm going to check if I can remove the boat on original image. Let me upscale the third option with two people in the boat. Now, I have to edit again using very region button. Let's highlight the boat on original image. Now, I'm going to submit with same prompt, 
without changing anything. Let's see how it goes. Now, we have the image with original boat removed. So, in this quick video, we were able to change an image, add more details as well as remove certain elements. In painting feature is awesome, and looks much more promising than any other recent feature. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel and like this video to see more AI related videos.